Hey, what's up, guys? You back with Cigar Talk Hawaii. Today, I got a new one for you. This is the Alex Bradley Black Market. It's a Robusto 5.2 by 52. Okay, now this is actually the first time I believe I'm smoking an Alex Bradley. Let's see. First impression, Jeff. Looks pretty good. It's got a nice long wrapper on it. Oh, chocolatey smell. Go ahead and slide this off. Yeah, that came off pretty easy. Pretty large. Got a small one on there. I'll go ahead and leave that on for right now. But looking at it, pretty nice and smooth. Like a, looks like a Snickers bar actually. A cigar shaped Snickers bar. Mild chocolatey flavors. Now this one, um, I guess it comes with a four country blend. You got uh, the Mastra, Honduran, Panama Long Fillers, capped with the um, Nicaraguan wrapper. Okay? So, without further ado, let's just go ahead and get this started. Got to go. Take a little bit off the tip there. We're going to go ahead and toast it up. Get it nice and toasty. See how this goes. Very smooth draw. Lots of smoke output right now, but the draw is smooth. The feel on it is kind of spongy. It looks hard here the first part, a little spongy toward the end. Hmm. Nothing special going on right now. The regular tobacco flavors. Mild on the spice, mild on the pepper. Right now, if I want to describe that, I would say you're using that, you know, that powdered pepper that come in like the cheap form that's real powdered out, that kind, not the cracked black pepper. That's what I'm getting right now. No other flavors really. I'll say slight chocolatey. Um, but it's just rolling like a straight cigar right now, which is cool. I like this so far. Hmm. Well, now that I inspect a little bit more, you see that? Yeah, that's kind of ugly looking right here. You see? I don't know what happened to that. Uh, let's see if it affects the, the burn. I hope that's why they're not using these long wrappers, yeah? Hmm. Okay. I think now that we got through the, the toasting part, She's starting to warm up a little bit, okay? The pepper flavor is starting to kick in a little bit more, a little bit more prominent. But it is nice and smooth, creamy. If this stays the way it, it is, you know, the rest of this, I would definitely recommend this right off the bat. Okay. Hmm. Now I'm probably gonna make this a one-shot video. We'll make it quick. I got some new equipment. I'm kind of testing it out right now. See how it goes. You guys hit me up in the comments if you think it looks better, sounds better, things like that, okay? I'm trying to get you guys the best content, the best I can do at the moment, okay guys? And right now we're gonna pair this up with a hard seltzer here that truly black cherry lemonade but I don't know where you guys
guys are at right now, guys. It is January. And you know what the weather is here. It's about 83, guys. Look at that. I'm sweating. Out by the pool. Okay, getting back to this. You know, I like the way this looks. I like the way the label, even the small label looks. It just looks like a nice professional cigar, if, if you know what I mean. Um, I really like it. I like the color on it. Hmm. Now this was launched in 2011. I believe it does have a high rating if I'm not mistaken. They say into the first third it's it's burning kind of uneven. Let's see if we can just correct that naturally. Actually, you know, guys, this might be a long smoke. So what I'll do, I'm going to work on this for a while. Maybe come back in the second or the third. If it doesn't change in the second, I'll come on down to the third and I'll get back with you. See how this goes. Peace.